A well-maintained lawnmower is easier to operate and lasts longer. Here's how to perform a quick spring tune-up. The first step is to change the spark plug. Remove the rubber spark plug boot. With a ratchet and a deep spark plug socket, remove the spark plug. Once it's loose, it's best to unscrew the plug by hand. Replace the spark plug with exactly the same model plug. Set the gap or space between the electrodes to a distance specified by the manufacturer. In this case, it's 30 thousandths of an inch. Start by screwing the new plug in by hand to avoid cross-threading. Then finish with a socket. After the spark plug is seated, give it one quarter turn more. Replace the spark plug boot, pressing down until you feel a click. Next, we're going to go under the mower to replace the blade, clean the bottom, and change the oil. First, detach the spark plug cap again so that the engine can't accidentally start. When you tilt the mower up, oil will often leak out of the oil breather vent. So place a collection pan to catch the drips from the vent. Place a block of wood against the grass chute and rest the blade against the wood to prevent it from moving when you loosen the bolt. Using a box wrench, loosen the bolt securing the blade. Mark the bottom of the blade with an X to help orient you when you install the new blade. And then remove the old blade and wooden block. Locate the oil drain plug. Using a scraper and a wire brush, Clean and scrape the area surrounding the oil plug, removing all caked-on grass clippings. Lay down sufficient newspapers to protect the work area, and place an oil collection pan to catch the waste oil. Using a ratchet, extension, and socket, remove the oil plug. Moving quickly to avoid spills, lower the mower so that the oil drains into the pan. Allow a few minutes for the oil to drain completely, and then lift the mower and quickly replace the oil drain plug. Tighten until snug with a ratchet and socket. Carefully dispose of the waste oil responsibly at an approved collection center. Remove the newspapers and lay down a tarp. It's time to clean the bottom. Using a scraper and a wire brush, clean and scrape the underside of the mower, removing all caked on grass clippings. With the bottom cleaned, it's time to install the new mower blade. Using the mark you made on the old blade, Orient the new blade so that they're facing the same way. Place the blade over the engine shaft and replace the bolt, tightening it until the bolt is snug. Wedge a block of wood against the edge of the casing and an engine bolt, and rest the new blade against the wood for support. With a box wrench, tighten down the bolt. Remove the wooden brace. Lower the mower. Open the oil drain cover and set it aside. Referring to your operator's manual, replace the oil with the required amount of 30 weight premium grade detergent motor oil. Slowly pour the oil into the oil filler tube, being careful not to overfill. Check the level of the oil with the oil dipstick. The oil should just reach the full line. Next, open the cover of the air filter. Inside, you'll typically find a foam air filter. Remove the foam air filter and rinse it in hot, soapy water. Squeeze out the filter and set it aside in the sun to dry completely. When the filter is completely dry, pour a few tablespoons of motor oil on the foam cleaner and knead the oil to distribute it throughout the filter. Squeeze out the excess. Wipe out the air cleaner housing and reinsert the foam filter. Replace the cover and fasten it in place. Replace the spark plug cap. Set the mower to start, give the mower a pull, and you're ready for another season.